This is Carly and I have some devastating news. Dr. Seuss books are leaking into our world, starting with flowers. It's only a matter of time before the bird people take over. What are you doing on my show? You were ten minutes late. I was getting things ready, performing a mic check, etc. Carly, we're live. Oh. Oh. Uh. With that out of the way, welcome to FOTW, also known as Flower of the Week. Our question of the day is, what are alliums and what are their characteristics? In order to answer this question, we have called over the flower enthusiast, Carolee Val E, who earlier I knocked out with a chair. It has dawned on me that we need her conscious to continue the broadcast. Get up. Carly, what are alliums and what are their characteristics? Well, alliums are really pretty and... Wow, that ice pack works wonders. Great. Great opinion, but... I'm pretty sure most of them are purple. You're getting warmer. You still haven't answered my question, though. I thought this was a podcast. No. What are alliums and what are their characteristics? Well, why didn't you say so? I did. Unlike other flowers, alliums have a distinct garlic smell. The reason for that is they're actually part of the onion family. Crazy, I know. Alliums also look kind of like the trophula trees from Dr. Seuss's The Lorax. Thank you for coming, Curly, but- Oh, what? I haven't even gotten started. I barely even answered your question. Uh. For their onion smell, they have achieved many names over the years. Some call them ornamental onions. Alliums can also be extremely tall. The biggest version is the Asian Alliantum Gigantium. This tree of a flower can be up to 5 feet tall, 1.5 meters. Alliums, along with many other flowers, are edible. Many variants of alliums taste sweet and garlicky, making them the best for salad dressings. People also compare them to leeks. Wait, how many allium variants are there? 260 variants. The smallest allium is only 5 centimeters tall. Can you talk about something interesting for a change? This is interesting. What do you mean? Ugh. There is a type of allium called the Everest Allium. The Everest Allium is known for, you guessed it, did you guess it? Growing on the tallest mountain in the world, Mount Everest. This flower has beautiful white flowers and is also a wee bit shorter than its relatives. It could grow up to three feet tall and have six inch wide pom-poms. What a creative name. I know, right? I'm ready to be done with this. Alrighty, more allium facts. Alliums come in a wide variety of colors, including white, yellow, pink, purple, or blue. And she fell asleep on me. Time to stop the broadcast. Bye, folks.